Folks, this is the second video that I'm making in that series. The first video kind of got long, so I'm not going to add pictures to it. But in the second video, I'll be adding six or seven photos with uh, with the, with the dyna dynamic range that I've pulled. So again, uh, <clears throat> what I did was I took all those pictures with the Nikon Z8. I took them with the 28mm f2.8. It's an amazing lens, very light walk around lens, fantastic lens. Uh, so with the Nikon Z8, it was 10 o'clock at night, dark, and my aim was to take pictures with an ISO of uh, 64 and uh, with an ISO of 64 and uh, 28 mm at f2.8, wide open. And most of the pictures that came or came out of the camera are dark. You can't see them. Let me see if I can show you one of those. Uh, right there yeah that's how the image coming out of that camera looks like if I can show you another one yeah that's how the image coming out of the camera looks like okay all I did was I played with the exposure, exposure slider and I pulled it towards the right in Lightroom I exposed the image to the point where it's legible, where it's visible enough for somebody to say, decide if it's a good picture or, or not. What I want you to do is go take a look at those pictures and provide your feedback. Tell me what you think about the image sensor. Tell me how, what you think about the noise. I have not done any noise reduction. It's just one slider, exposure, that's about it. And you can see the power of that Nikon sensor, the kind of data that it captures um, as it's taking pictures, right? Fantastic, fantastic experience. So far, I have enjoyed my camera and I'm going to keep this camera for a long time. I don't think I'm going to buy another camera for a long time because it kind of fulfills all my needs. Just one camera for video. I might end up keeping the ZFC that's recording me right now because again, it's one of my favorite cameras. Lightweight, walk around lens, videos, photos, everything is good, but it's autofocus is not as great as this. But it's a good autofocus, right? I, I can see it on my eyes right now. It's, 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 it's an amazing camera, guys. Autofocus is not a problem with the Z, ZFC, but this is the class leading autofocus that I'm talking about, which the ZFC does not have, okay? Um, Finally, Nikon, I am very thankful for you to keep upgrading our Nikon Z9. The latest form of 4.0 was fantastic. Keep them coming. Um, you have given us basically three new cameras with version 2, 3 and 4 of the firmware updates. Um, where if I compare you with, my, with Sony and Canon, they would have essentially given us three different bodies with new features. Something that Apple does a lot, right? Every year they release a new phone or a phone body that pretty much does the same thing that the older body was doing <laughs> with a few slight features here and there and uh, a lot of more and, and a lot more money. So that keeps their business running. Nikon, you have sacrificed that for us. Uh, the Z9 that I own today is completely different from the Z9 that I owned 14 months ago you have essentially given us three cameras so again that was a z9 thing that i wanted to thank nikon for uh, guys back to the z8 nikon z8 go take a look look at all the pictures that i have coming up now they are from the nikon z8 okay hopefully you love it if you like it subscribe subscribe to my channel because i'll be bringing up more videos going forward i just enjoy talking to you guys so i'll be, i'll be bringing up more videos going going forward okay and if you want to see something in the z8 if i can show that to you that will help you make a decision uh, i'll do that remember this is not coming in from a huge influencer who are controlled by the bigger companies on what they say you are getting first-hand information from somebody who has used the Nikon, who has used the Sony, who has used the Canon, who has used the Z9, who has used the Z8. Um, if, you're this, if you want to buy the Z8, I can give you the first-hand information. And I'm not influenced by you or by any company. Whatever comes out of here and here is factual and truthful. 
Talk to you soon, guys. And hopefully you enjoy the images, okay? Thanks, bye.